Mark is going to tell me about this beautiful RGB memory that everyone's been talking about. Mark, why is this the hot thing at CES? So a lot of people have sold RGB memory over the years, but every time you plug them into a system and they start running after a little while, they no longer are synchronized. The colors all start going in different directions and you don't know what it, it doesn't give you that look that you're looking for. So our engineers spent some time and they came up with that aha moment of why don't we take remote control technology, that, which is typically that infrared signal that you send to your TV to change channels. We take that infrared technology, drop them onto the modules so that the modules communicate with each other and stay in rhythm forever, basically. Don't do what I'm doing right now. Okay. But what we did is we actually put in a, a, a piece of paper or plastic between the modules to block the inter infrared remote control signal between the modules. Got it. So two of them are actually talking and communicating and blinking together. Mm -hmm. The other two are sitting there going, hey, I'm, I'm waiting for a signal before I can start. So what I can do is I can pull the paper out and all four go into full synchronized mode. So it's actually something that's never been done before. And when you do it, you're able to basically set up your system where it's always looking the way you did at the very beginning. It's great stuff. Yeah, that is some really cool tech. It's, it's new, it's never been done before. It is patent pending, and it's something we're gonna continue uh, improving on. It's, it's called the Predator DDR4 RGB memory. And again, Q2 timeframe. All right, well, Mark, right. thank you so much, guys. Stay tuned for more CES coverage right here.